And in Rochester, the Mayo Civic Center hosted an annual Mario Kart tournament today. KIMT News 3's Jerome Barnett takes us through the game to Coconut Mall. Money raised from this event will go toward both local and national childhood cancer initiatives. Dozens of people competed in the tournaments. There was a tournament for adults and one for kids. They raced against each other on the course Coconut Mall with characters they chose. They were double elimination tournaments, meaning that a competitor could lose once and still end up winning the tournament they were in. Unused Nintendo Switches were the prizes. The event organizer explains how this event came to be. My son Nathan was diagnosed with high-risk lymphoblastic lymphoma just about two weeks after his fourth birthday. And treatment for lymphoma and leukemia is about two and a half to three years of chemotherapy. And it's a lot of time in the hospital. And the thing that got him through all the pokes and prods and feeling nauseous and the hair loss was video games. And so it was a no-brainer to model this fundraiser uh, off of video games. And one of his favorite video games is Mario Kart. And so to put this in uh, tournament format and have the community rally behind it and raise some money for childhood cancer is just uh, kind of a dream come true. The event was held this month because September is Childhood Cancer Awareness Month. In Rochester, Jerome Barnett, KIMT News 3. And if you'd like to be a part of next year's fundraiser, that cost is $30 if you want to race and free admission if you're just looking to watch.